G'day, welcome back to another episode. In this episode, we're going to be going over the Cerasel Brewer Mite test bottle and how to use it and when to use it. Now, first, before um, you get started, um, you want alcohol um, for the system to work. It's an alcohol wash. Now, what you can do is simply go to your local hardware store, you can get methylated spirits, or you can get some high concentrated. Um, spirit. Now I've got isopropyl alcohol which is a really high concentration. You don't need it that high, you simply just need it at about 20% to kill the bees. Um, so what I've done here is I've done um, uh, four part water to one part uh, isopropyl mix which gives me about a 20% concentration that way you're not wasting all your alcohol 20% will kill the bees. Now, when you want to use this, you want to use this to measure your mite count at the beginning of your strips and at the end of your strip application or varroa control application. That way, when you put your strips in, you know how many mites your hive and or average apiary has and then you know at the end of the application, say eight weeks down the track, you know how successful and or non-successful your um, varroa kill um, for your varroa strip application was. That way you can accurately analyze what your varroa control or varroa count is within your hive um, for your specific period of time. Okay, so now all we want to do is simply just lift up the frames, make sure the queen isn't on any of the frames, and then we'll simply just place the bottle there and just gently shake the bees in there until you get about enough bees up to this marker on the bottle which is the sort of second tier on the little grate and that's about 300 100 bees so that's the number we want to go for about 300 and then we can work out our uh, varroa count calculations from there so what we'll do is we'll quickly just pull these up, make sure the queen isn't on the frame, so I can't see the queen, so we'll just, see I'm just gently, and they're just kind of gradually trickling into the bottle, and then when we kind of just Gently chuck them down, and as we fill up with alcohol, and then you close the lid, and then from there, you fill it up just a little bit, and then you just shake for 30 seconds. So, yeah, you basically just want to stir it for about 30 to 30 seconds to a minute. That way, all the varroa then fall down to the bottom, and then we can work out what our percentage of infestation is. All you need to do is then lift the grate up. Oh, got quite a few. And I can see one on on the grate there. There's two. Oh, it's not good. <laughs> it's not good. 26. That's not good. <laughs> 26. So number of dead mites divide by three, 8.6. So um, that hive's got an 8.6% um, percent viral infestation, which is not good. So anything above two, you need to take action. Um, right away um, so yeah we'll do a quick sort of shot over top to show what it looks like so that's a real quick video on how to use the Cerasel Varroa Mite test bottle I hope you enjoyed please like and subscribe for more videos thanks again